Um, Harris is asking, um, what is the update on the Saudi-Canada relationship? Uh, I, I think uh, for the most part, it's uh, the same. The diplomatic ties are still cut. Armin, correct me if I'm wrong. I know that they've relaxed some stuff on the uh, the students staying here. I don't know about the hospitals or all the other stuff that they did, but uh, they're apparently still doing negotiations in the background and trying to figure out what they're going to do. But uh, diplomatic ties are still cut. I know that Saudi Airlines has suspended all flights out of Canada, which is interesting because my uh, my uh, my father-in-law actually came here on a Saudi flight and he had to go back on a Saudi flight. Now he had to change everything because you know he could he can't he can't go back uh, because Saudi isn't flying out of Toronto anymore. So. Yeah, it's. Um, I, I I just um, for me it's still in flux. They actually got forced into this position, like mm. they didn't say anything when it mattered. They didn't say yeah. anything like even though Trudeau promised to be tougher on Saudi Arabia, to be tougher on uh, human rights violations, to be, uh, you know. But when he came to power, he basically went fully silent, right? It did, like, I think as soon as you come to power, they realize how much money is involved and how much how much of a political suicide it is to say anything against Saudi Arabia, right? Yeah. Saudi Arabia's foreign policy, I think, it's been run like it's run, being run by a whole bunch of like four year olds because I'm I'm pretty sure there's smarter guys there that are they just don't have access to power anymore because of Ben Salman, but um, they basically forced Canada in a position to take a tough stance against Saudi Arabia. And that Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim majority countries, advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.